your boy E Neil back with another reaction video, guys. We are here with a very funny guy. I'm gonna try to hold in the last, but it's not possible. We got Jeff Foxworthy, uh, the difference in men's and women's noses. This, this should be interesting. But well, before we jump into this, it is day 14 of the Dream Team 25 Days of Christmas, which means you get 14 reaction videos today. I hope you sit here with me and enjoy them all. Uh, also, since you're going to be here anyway, smack that subscribe button. Ring the notification bell, get a video a thumbs up so it gets suggested. Social media, Patreon in the corner. Put all those links down in the description. So all you got to do is hit the link, follow me, talk to me. Guys, I'm human. I talk bad. Who you got, Jim? But the cool thing that has me from working with all these women is through the years, I've learned a ton of things about women. And, and one of the things that I've recently realized is that men and women both appreciate smells. But we do not appreciate the same kinds of smells. <laughs> we apparently appreciate pleasant smells. <laughs> you give a woman a bouquet of flowers, they're like, oh, that smells like heaven. You give a man a bouquet of flowers, we're like, Smells like 50 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Bro, I already know Jeff about this fit facts because that, that was a big one right there. That was a big one right there. Jeff's in facts all okay, okay. Smells like 50 bucks. <laughs> the women love flowers and perfume and potpourri and those scented candles. You know, you yes. see men in a wits and sticks. Hey, Jack! <laughs> Ever. Ever. Hey, Barry. <laughs> but women spend billions of dollars on things that smell good trying to cover up things that smell bad. And men spend Thanks. billions of dollars on things that just smell bad. <laughs> a bottle of dough in heat urine we can entertain ourselves for the weekend. <laughs> He's telling the truth, bro. He's telling the truth. It, billions of bucks on things that just smell bad, and billions of things that cover up things that smell bad. It's facts. Yeah. <laughs> Your turn. I used to have a little spray bottle for mine, but my wife took it away from me because at last year's family Christmas party, somebody sprayed some on her brother's pants leg, and then our dog fell in love with him. And my wife said it was funny, but everybody that's seen the video just says it's funny. So, I'm going with funny. But men have an appreciation for unpleasant smells. Have like you ever seen a guy cleaning out a closet and he'll find a gym bag that he's forgotten about for five or six months, you know, with sweaty workout clothes in it, and he'll open it up and like, oh, man! Yeah. Oh, that is the stinkiest thing I've ever smelled in my life! Charlie, come here and smell this! Such facts. That is that is exactly exactly what happens. Right? Smell it. <laughs> oh my and God! Having heard all of that, we'll get off the couch, walk across the room, and not only <laughs> smell it, I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that dog a buzzard off a gut wagon. Ralph, come here and smell. And I said, no, it's not. You just don't understand what's taking place. Mm -hmm. I said, man number two and three, out of the goodness of their heart, are giving man number one a courtesy sniff. <laughs> and from now on, man number one owes man number two and three a courtesy sniff in return. And man number two and three are banking on somewhere down the road. They'll come up with something stinkier than what man number one has. 
seen a car that's sitting at a red light. And there's like five guys there. And all of a sudden, all four windows go down, and there's four guys hanging out of the car, just cussing like crazy. And there's one guy sitting in the middle in the back, just laughing. I swear, I swear on everything. On everything that I love. Oh my gosh. This is as accurate as, as it gets. He bullseye, right? Bullseye, I'm telling you. It, <laughs> that is exactly what Sitting happened. In the middle of the back, just laughing. <laughs> you know why he's laughing? <laughs> <laughs> he's cased in his courtesy snap. <laughs> and the only thing that could make him happier was had he been driving and had control of the window lock. I swear, I, bro, that was one of the funniest things, bro. Jeff Fosworthy, we need more. I need more. That, shout out to you on that one. That was hilarious. That's all I got for this. Uh, if you guys got a favorite song or artist or video you want to hear me react to, don't hesitate to drop in the comments and just well, the comment section is there. Before you leave, make sure you hit subscribe. You ring the notification bell. You get a video a thumbs up. So I guess I just said social media head on in the corners. Put all the links down in the description, so all you gotta do is hit the link, follow me, talk to me, no talking to you guys. You guys are the most incredible to you on YouTube. It's your boy Dini, out. What's up, guys? So there's guys, I, the, what are you, I don't know what you're still doing here. It's the end of the video. You can go. Uh, I'm just here. There's this thing on YouTube, you know what I'm saying? If you get the video past eight minutes, you're able to put a little sticker, little ad in the middle of it. I need that money. And so, hey, yeah, that's why we're here. But uh, we're about to go to black screen until it goes past eight minutes. So if you want to look at a black screen, that's okay. Oh, if not, see what.